Hey guys, this is Red from Pokemon Hub, and today I'm going to be showing you how to download and set up the Pokemon Online Battle Simulator. Um, this is this can be got really easily by just you have to enter this in your address bar, Pokemon-Online.eu/download. Um, I will also include this link in the description, so for those of you who can't really be bothered to type it, you can just copy and paste. And then once you've entered that, you'll come to this page here. Uh, just refresh to show you it's live. Um, then you come to this page, then you can see you can get a download for Windows, Linux, Android, and or Mac. Um, I presume most of you will be using Windows, so you just click download Windows, but it's the same process for absolutely all of these. Actually, I'm not so sure about Android, but it's basically really, really easy. Anyway, once you've clicked download, you then just need to run through the really quick and easy installation process. Having done that, it will then be installed somewhere on your computer, um, the place where you designated for it. And you just open it up, then you then you'll get this easy to navigate menu. Having got here, you then click on the first option, Team Builder. This is where you can first create your Pokemon party and your actual trainer information. So first of all, you can enter your trainer name, whatever you want. You can then choose your own custom avatar, pick whatever you want. Team Tier. If you don't really know what this is, it's absolutely fine, you just leave that blank. But for 99% of the cases you'll be using this, you just need to enter OU. That sounds so overused. And then anyway, enter your train information, winning message, losing message, whatever you want. And then, as you can see, up here is team. This has my team in it, which I want to keep secret because I'm about to enter the Pokemon Hub League. Um, so I don't want to expose that yet, so I'm not going to show you guys that quite yet. Then there's a box, so where you can store your Pokemon, just like in the game. And then there's the Pokedex, and this is also really easy to navigate. You just enter the name of Pokemon you want to find. Uh, let's say Dragonite. And you, oh god, sorry, uh, Dragonite, then you, then you get this, and you see its abilities, click on stats, you can see what it's weak to, resistances, immunity, and all its possible moves. And that is the basic way to do it. Oh yes, and then you just click save, you then, you then enter its name, save it, then you just close that, and having done that, you then click go online, and then you can join whichever server you want. I personally normally play on Pokemon Online, advanced connection. Then you will should be able to join without problem, and yep, and here we go, and you're in, and you can just click find battle, and then you're off. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for watching this um, short tutorial on how to set up your Pokemon Online and get up and running. And if you enjoyed it, please give a like. If you really enjoyed it, come out, come and check out www.pokemonhub.com. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.